Hi everyone, I'm Bronwyn Fitz. I'm an integrative gynecologist and functional medicine doctor. I wanted to talk a little bit today about inflammation. Inflammation is the underlying driver of so many of our chronic illnesses that we see. And we uh, talk about inflammation a lot in the, from the functional medicine and integrative uh, medical paradigms. Uh, it's something we talk a lot about. Uh, and I'm just really inspired right now because I saw an article this morning uh, that was recently published in the journal Nature that uh, addresses the question of inflammation during pregnancy and its consequences on um, the babies. And so I'm an OBGYN, so you know a lot of my uh, patients come to me looking for um, you know things that they can do to optimize their fertility and then to optimize the wellness of their pregnancy to have the healthiest pregnancy and healthy baby they can. So this study was just so fascinating because what they did was they um, took a group of women who were pregnant and they measured IL-6 levels. So IL-6 is interleukin-6. It's a marker of systemic inflammation. They um, measured these women's IL-6 levels several times during their pregnancy. And then after they delivered in the newborns, they did functional MRI scans of the newborn's brains and they looked at um, patterns and then they brought these mother baby pairs back two years later and they analyzed the working memory of these now two-year-old toddlers and they could adequately predict the IL-6 levels back in pregnancy based on the, um, the scores on the memory tests and the functional MRI patterns they saw. So the more inflamed you were during pregnancy, uh, the, the um, bigger impact it was going to have on the brain patterns and on the uh, working memory of your now two-year-old child. So, you know, we often tell patients that inflammation is, is the underlying source of so many issues. Now we have just more and more objective data um, sort of proving this, this, um, this point. Um, so what I do is I recommend that all women come see me for a functional medicine consult before pregnancy and, you know, give me one, two visits. Um, I still want you to see your regular OBGYN and all your regular doctors, but we can address some of these underlying um, drivers of inflammation and optimize your pregnancy. And if you can't get to see me, there's just five quick categories you can try to start working on for yourself. Number one is diet. Eat an anti-inflammatory diet. If you do one thing, remove added sugar. Added sugar, sugar is like the number one um, driver of inflammation in the typical American diet. Um, healthy oils, avoiding processed foods, I can go on and on, but you know, if you do one thing, take out added sugar and processed foods. Um, number two is um, your GI tract. If you have any kind of irritable um, GI symptoms, um, it's a sign that you have inflammation um, going on in the GI tract. And so you can come in and um, we can uh, evaluate what's going on there. Usually it's diet related. So um, cleaning up your diet often helps um, the, the GI symptoms. Um, number three is toxins. If you, toxins are very inflammatory. So we want you to um, avoid pesticides in your food. We want you to um, uh, avoid plastics and look at all the chemicals in your um, skincare and your um, healthcare products. I love Environmental Working Group. Um, you can go to their web website, ewg.org, and um, do a little inventory of your food and your um, healthcare products there. Remove all the toxic chemicals. Uh, the fourth thing we think about um, in terms of decreasing inflammation systemically is um, stress. Stress is huge. Stress is very inflammatory. The cortisol hormone is very inflammatory. So I always help um, people manage their stress. And then the last one is um, infections in your immune system. And so taking a probiotic, you know, is helpful for a lot of people. A lot of people have uh, bacterial overgrowth in their colon or in their small bowel or other kind of chronic infections, whether it's Epstein-Barr or Lyme's disease or things like that. We want to um, optimize your, um, your immune system and clear out any infections. And these are the um, five things that 
you can start doing on your own to um, limit and decrease the amount of inflammation you have systemically. Um, if anyone's interested in making an appointment with me, uh, you can reach us at uh, womensintegrativehealth.com, 203-900-4194. Have a great day.